Hi, organizers. Welcome back to At Home with Charlize. I'm Charlize, and I have a dream of an organized home. Let's get started. The last time we got together, we expanded my spice drawer situation. Remember that? Okay. And in doing that, Let's look at this. I was able to clear up some space in this cupboard. All I have to do is take this down because all those spices that were in there are in the drawer now. And the only thing that's on this shelving in here is these few things. You see that? So that's all clear. Now I think it would be nice if I could use this to uh, to put some product on, but I'm not sure that that's gonna work. So I may end up taking this out, okay? And then that means, whoops, 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 whoops. Okay, that means that I have uh, all this space here and this space here. So let's see what I come up with. These baskets here, they're doing the job, but they are not very pleasing to the eye. So I've shopped my home like I'm always telling you to do, and I found a couple of more of those baskets that I have had for a few years that I purchased from Dollar Tree that I was not using that I may be able to use. I think these will look much nicer if it'll work. And also I got these little containers here. I think I got these from Michael some years ago too. But anyway, I may use them, I may not, but I just thought I would remind you when you're talking about storage uh, containers, that sort of thing, shop your home first and then go out and buy something. Okay, organizers. Let's see the semi-finished product. And I say semi because I'm not 100% done. Um, like I said, I shopped my home and I found these three baskets. And this first one, I put these are all those uh, microwave rices. I have all my packets of like taco seasonings and gravies and that sort of thing here. I have packs of tuna, and behind that I have some ramen noodles. And in here, I have some uh, some baking things like vanilla uh, spice, I mean vanilla flavoring and uh, lemon flavoring and that sort of things. And I just stuck those toothpicks up there where I could see them. And this was my main reason for do doing this, because I wanted to have some of my canned goods in the kitchen. All right, I have um, on each row, like here, I have three cans of green beans, three cans of peas, three cans of corn, three cans of chicken noodle soup. Here I have, uh, I have Progresso. It's, this one's New England clam chowder, but there's also chicken noodle back there. I have three cans of pink salmon, and above that, I have, um, three cans of tuna. And here I have my um, cupcake liners and then some other stuff like baking powder and whatnot. F stuff for baking is behind that. Now here's where I'm not finished yet. I want to go and get a couple of more of uh, these pie pans, cake pans, and marbles if they still carry that stuff at Dollar Tree and set up another one of these because it really makes it easy to 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 get to the different um oops the different things that I have uh in the way of condiments I think this steak sauce might be a little bit too tall but anyway okay um so I there are a few uh spices and odds and ends back there that I would like to put in something like this so that I can just uh rotate it around and see what's there um, the honey, salt, and pepper, 
peanut butter that that I put in the front because we we reach for that often several times during the course of the week but uh, for the most part I'm pretty pleased with the outcome um, I have to juice it a little bit more but like I always say guys this is how we organize our homes one small space at a time and now by doing this I freed up space in my makeshift pantry uh, that's in the laundry room all right guys that's all I got for you today I will see you next time bye guys <music>